This last clip is from a patrol officer who swears he keeps seeing shadows on and inside of this building. 422. This place definitely gives out some creepy vibes. From encountering criminals to encountering ghosts, law enforcement officers have to face it all in their line of duty. What will happen when cops encounter scary stuff while on duty? Let's witness the moments when horrifying activities happened with the cops. Moving on to our first case that occurred during a late night shift on April 11, 2017, in Malacca, Malaysia. Freaky incident happened just after 4 a.m. at the Bandar Hilir police station in Malacca, Malaysia. No one had expected this to happen when every cop was busy on the late night shift. This eerie clip shows officers jumping up and going to investigate after the glass entrance doors open, though no one standing outside or nearby. If you look closely, the door opens in the opposite direction than the way it usually opens. The entrance exit doors open simultaneously, but in the opposite direction. People claimed that the ghost died in the station coming back to take revenge. The officers quickly went towards the door, but it was of no use. It spooked all the officers working at the time. Sheikh Abdul adds as Sheikh Abdullah insisted the door open because of a technical fault. He said, I have confirmed that the doors in the police station opened and one broke, but I have not received any reports just yet. The incident may be affected by wind pressure and I am still waiting for the reports from the policemen present at the scene. It's been seven years, but still, there were no signs of technical fault or any human behind this. It was a paranormal activity that still haunts the officers working on late night shifts there. With that being said, let's move on to our second case. On March 14, 2017, cops in Brazil responded to a noise complaint filed by the school staff working there in school. The noise can only be heard from one floor. Little did the cops know they wouldn't encounter any criminal, but this.
Yes, they didn't witness any human making this noise by shutting doors this loudly. It was some creature that couldn't be seen by officers. Probably a ghost. With fear running down their spines, they stepped forward to find a reason for this paranormal activity. It wasn't just a door being violently slammed, but a small fire suppression system. As they got close to it, the noise disappeared, and there wasn't a single sign of wind in that lobby. But another slamming noise started coming as soon as the cops turned their backs. Close the It's still a mystery. Some activities don't have an explanation with them. Indeed, some creatures still hate humans and don't miss a chance to haunt them. But this is nothing compared to this next case where the eerie creature didn't stop chasing the cop's car. On a chilling night of August 12, 2018, a cop in Saharanpur, Uttar Pradesh, was on a night patrol. He must not have planned to encounter this eerie haunted creature while crossing this spooky, eerily silent neighborhood. While he was reversing to get away from this crazy white dress creature, it kept walking towards the car in such a ghostly way. Either it was a possessed woman or a ghost scaring locals. It just disappeared for a while, but then showed up again. The cop was scared as hell. Indeed, a horrible night for a patrol officer. Do you think someone tried to scare the officer or it was some kind of ghost? Let's move on to our fourth case. On 12 April 2018, the strange incident occurred just after 5.30 a.m. on Thursday. The New South Wales Police Department uploaded the video of the eerie footage recorded by their surveillance camera. This mysterious footage left shivers down their spine.
members of a police department in Australia, were left scratching their heads, after spotting some potential ghostly activity, captured via their CCTV system. Posting the video to their Facebook page, the New South Wales Police Force explained that a garage door in their parking lot had been inexplicably left open despite the area not being used for days. The video caption claimed that, just before dawn, with the car park empty and quiet, a garage that hadn't been used in days suddenly started to open on its own. As you can see with the door half open a broom flies out, it stays upright for a few seconds but then falls to the ground. Curious as to who may have been responsible for the oversight, officers examined the security camera footage from the lot, and were surprised to find that the door had actually opened on its own. And, in a chilling culmination to the weird scene, with the door half open, a broom flies out, as if propelled by a spirited unseen force. It stays upright, then falls to the ground and gives one final kick, looking like it's in the final throes of possession. According to the police department, they've enlisted a technician to examine what appears to be a faulty door, and quipped that dealing with the demonic possessed broom is a job best handled by a parapsychologist, who investigates paranormal and psychic phenomena. North Wales Police Department claimed that a technician is currently inspecting the door. The possessed broom sounds like a job for the ghost dusters, but it still terrified a lot of officers working there. The members of a police department are still scratching their heads after spotting this paranormal ghostly activity. Moving on to our fifth case. On October 10th, 2023, a simple traffic stop turned into a horrible encounter for this cop. The footage shocked the whole police department and later became questionable to the public as well. It was recorded by bodycam and dashcam. No one could claim that it was fake. Can you even see it? All right. um, no this worries. is my first time being pulled over. All right. Can I see your driver's license registration, please? Yeah. Um, it's not a big deal. Here's my license, but uh, this is my mom's car, so... Where are you headed to where you're speeding and missing stop signs? I was just headed to a friend's house. It's like literally right there. It's um, okay. a birthday party. So, Got it. Um, not mine, but... Any drugs or alcohol in the vehicle? No, of course not. All right. Sit tight, Sarah. I'll be right back. Okay. Just a normal routine traffic stop. The cop asked for a license and registration. But as soon as he turned towards his patrol car to run the information, this happened. Your registration is... What the? Sarah? What the hell? Sarah? 3201? The girl Sarah just disappeared like that into the air. The dash cam shows no sign of any door of her car open or anything like that. There was no one around who had helped Sarah escape. It's as creepy as it sounds. Or maybe there's a glitch in the matrix, but no one is talking about it. Your registration is exp what the sarah what the hell sarah 3201 i can't even see it right. um no this worries. is my first time being pulled over all right can i see your driver's license registration please yeah um it's not a big deal here's my license but uh this is my mom's car so where are you headed to where you're speeding and missing stop signs i was just headed to a friend's house it's like literally right there it's um, okay. a birthday party so, got it um, not mine but any drugs or alcohol in the vehicle no of course not all right sit tight sarah i'll be right back okay did some unknown creature take her from that day onwards there was no sign of a girl named sarah cops weren't able to trace her id her true identity remains a mystery. Whether the sky engulfed her or the earth took her, Sarah's mystery remains like that. Let's move on to our sixth case of a ghostly car. On October 4th, 2022, a patrol officer noticed a black Corvette recklessly driving on a busy highway. Without any second thought, the cops started chasing the car, also signaling the driver to pull over.
This high-speed chase was about to come to an end as the cops approached the car, but rather than slowing the vehicle down, the driver inside the vehicle escalated the speed. Not only that, but what is about to happen next will leave you shaken. was just now on the road disappeared. Was it another haunted car or did the car travel into another space? We will never know. But let's move on to our seventh case of a mysterious creature. On July 18th, 2022, the Kentucky Police Department received disturbing footage. The video showed an eerie creature that was neither a human nor an animal. Not only that the creature was moving around in a very strange manner, locals were terrified after witnessing such a video from their neighborhood. No one can figure out what it was, but its way of moving shows that it was looking for something. It sends chills down the spine to anyone who watches for more than a minute. Locals also claim of witnessed paranormal activity around their homes after this footage went viral. You see his face clearly. Right there. This mysterious figure left the internet puzzled as well. Moving on to our eight cases. On October 27, 2018, one of the female officers at the Honolulu Police Department decided to share a paranormal activity that happened to her coworker when she used to work at District 5. Her coworker was a rookie at that time, and her job was to close the gates of the Polly Lookout. So about 18 years ago, when I first started, um, I was assigned to District 5, Kalihi, and one of my beat partners told me the most eerie story, um, something that happened to her at the Pali Lookout. So one of the things that we have to do in District 5 is make checks of the Pali Lookout and Pali Highway. Also at nighttime, we have to go up there and lock both gates. So at that time, my, my beat partner was a blue and white driver. She was still a rookie. She said she was, she had to, she was assigned to close the poly gates that night. And most officers, they don't like to go and they don't like to, you know, close the gates because it's so dark up there to probably look out. She said she pulled up to the first gate and she locked that one and she, she got back in her car and she drove going towards into the poly lookout. The part of her job was done but there was another gate that needed to be closed. Little did she know what she was about to encounter on her way there. A woman, but not just a woman, a spirit. But as she drove in, she saw something white. She remembered stories where officers would get into accidents because, you know, they drive past this white figure. So she drove closer, and as she got closer, it appeared to be uh, a lady wearing a white dress. And she was like, oh, I better stop and ask to see if she's okay. So when she pulled up and she started rolling down her window, but as she turned out and looked out the window to start asking the lady why she was there, she felt this eerie feeling in the blue and white. And that's when she looked in the rear view mirror and she realized the lady was sitting in the back seat of the blue and white. I remember her telling me that her um, grandmother always told her if you do encounter any kind of spirit or anything, you need to stay calm and you need to talk to the spirit. So as she is driving, the lady's in the back seat, she kept talking to the lady. Oh, what are you doing out here, Auntie? Here in Hawaii, we would call someone who's either older than us or, um, you know, especially if we don't know their name, we would call them, oh, Auntie, do you need help with something? Oh, Auntie, you need something from the store? We refer to them and it's kind of respectful in that way. So to stay calm, she kept talking to the lady. And the whole time, the lady sat there, said nothing, and was looking down. When she got to the second gate, she got out, quickly closed that gate. She didn't freak out, but 
handled the spirit as the old people say. The officer telling the story claims that as soon as she stepped out to lock the second gate, she turned back towards her vehicle. But when she looked in her back mirror again, this happened. The lady was still sitting in the back seat after she crossed all the tunnels and finally reached the station. She looked in the mirror for one last time. She knew that that spirit was still in the back seat. So she got back in and she, she, she continued to talk to the person. You know, oh, I don't have anything to offer you right now. I'm just doing my job. You know, I have to lock the gates. I have to drive around and I do have to go through the tunnels, but you know, I cannot take you all the way to Kanyohi, to Kailua, because that's out of my district. But you know, um, I want you to be safe. And she, she kind of told that to the spirit. And the whole time, the lady sat there, said nothing, and was looking down. So as she was driving down, she went through the tunnels and she just felt this overwhelming peace. You know, she just felt at peace. And then she, she looked up into the rear view mirror and she noticed that the lady was gone. Yes, the spirit was gone, as if she was never there. Was it a spirit or a woman's ghost? We will never know. Many people claim to have witnessed a mysterious lady walking alone on Old Polly Road. With that being said, let's move on to our ninth case. On July 8th, 2023, scary body cam footage was revealed. An officer was out on duty on his patrol, but he was about to encounter some paranormal activities at a house he was searching after getting a noise complaint. This was just the start of horrifying activities. And it's site 422. This last clip is from a patrol officer who swears he keeps seeing shadows on and inside of this building. Site 422. This place definitely gives out some creepy vibes. The body cam captures something or someone on the inside of this abandoned building, yet no one is supposed to. As you see, there was an unexplainable shadow around the window. The atmosphere around this house was so eerie, and there were spooky, there were silent screams everywhere. Supposed to be inside. I keep seeing shadows walking by. What the f Did the cop run back or continue his search? Did he make his way back or not? These mysteries will always remain like this. For our last case, we have a forest patrol officer being disturbed by eerie screams. On 27th June 2023, a cop was on his daily patrol around the forest when he observed some unusual activities behind the tall grasses. He decided to investigate it, but little did he know there was no human behind the bush. Hey, I got a cryptid over here that won't come out. I need some assistance. I know you're in there. Come on out. Come out with your hands up. Yeah, he's code three back here. Cryptid, come out. With your hands up, we have you surrounded. You better not throw anything. No one came out upon several orders. The cop ordered again and again. There was no sound, but only creepy sounds and moments were coming from behind. Don't growl at me, I hear you, come out now. We're coming in. We're gonna have to get the whole squad for this one. Tim, man, you got your ears on. We got a cryptid that's coming, not coming out. I got movement. Give up. Was there something behind it? What was that? As the night deepens and the shadows grow longer, these chilling encounters remind us that some mysteries are destined to remain unsolved. From the eerie halls of abandoned buildings to the silent forests where unseen eyes watch, the paranormal continues to disturb our understanding. 
These 10 cases captured on video and witnessed by those brave enough to recount their stories serve as a haunting reminder. We are never truly alone. When the moon is high and the wind whispers through the trees, who knows what otherworldly beings might be lurking just out of sight. For more videos like this make sure you hit the subscribe button and like this video. Comment below which case you find the most terrifying. Don't forget to press the bell icon for future notifications.